Hi, I'm Peter from uRender. In this video, I will show you our new color correction curves. Open the Render Settings and in the Post Processing tab you find the curves in the Filter section. Here are some hints for using them. If you want to increase the contrast of your image, I recommend to use the curves instead of the contrast slider. The advantage is that when using curves, it is much easier to prevent highlights from getting burnt out or dark areas from turning to black. Just press Ctrl A to select all points. Right mouse click, go to point times and choose Easy Ease. Now you instantly get a classical S-curve and this means increased contrast. When adjusting the tensions, you can press Ctrl for locking them in their current direction. You also can decrease the contrast by setting an inverse S-curve. You can insert as many points as you need by pressing Ctrl and left click. If you need to reset your curve, just right click and reset. You also can use the Show Separate Window option to get a larger window. Also remember the strength slider to blend your filter if needed. The curves give you more possibilities for adjustment than the brightness contrast gamma sliders and it is really easy to get different styles very quickly. So I hope you enjoy it. Thanks for watching.